Finally tonight, a new experience is in store for visitors at the Hong Kong Palace Museum, which opens its doors to the public next week. They can enjoy five digital works of art created by a Baptist University professor who blended traditional artifacts with modern technology. Joanna Ho went to have a look. The latest addition to Hong Kong's cultural scene will feature five new media art pieces. Dreamscape of the Qianlong Emperor The Ancestral Hall and Imperial Portraits Flying Mythological Horses Lenticular procession of tribute horses and eight interactive horses will be on display in the Hong Kong Palace Museum, which opens next month. They were created by Jeffrey Shaw, chair professor of the Academy of Visual Arts at Baptist University, and his team. This is Shaw's studio at the Baptist University. The video projected on the screen behind me demonstrates one of his works in which the horses can interact with members of the audience who come close to the censors. The white-on-black digital artwork took cues from the Qing Dynasty masterpiece, Eight Horses, painted by Italian missionary Giuseppe Castiglione in the 18th century. Instead of projecting still images, the horses on the screen can move as if they are interacting with human and other horses. Another piece, Dreamscape of the Qianlong Emperor, also engages with members of the audience. Visitors lie down on a couch to watch the emperor's dream about his deceased wife. Shaw says he wants to create a dialogue between the past and the present, as well as between the artifacts and the audience. I think in general, museums today, uh, if they are to be contemporary, even if they are museums of the past, yeah, museum talk, talking about history, they have to engage new media, they have to engage uh, the language that uh, people are using today, you know, the literacy of today is moving images. Shaw said after overcoming technological challenges, his wish is for visitors to enjoy his work. Joanna Ho, HKIBC.